with all the epoxy on there. Make sure you get it on the bottom too. Put some on the bottom. So when the stuff go out, start going down, I mean this epoxy, this is what I did. It was a cheaper one, the one that I can't afford, but it's kind of thicker than the one that I usually get. So we're gonna see how it turn out. Practice makes perfect. Kind of thicker than the one I usually get, but Make sure you cover your whole tumbler with epoxy. Okay, changing this glove again. You're gonna change your gloves a lot. So now, gonna mix your colors so okay I'm using three colors I already got epoxy in this one if I need another cup because you don't need that much okay so you're gonna mix you're gonna have to put your epoxy in each cup and mix your color with whatever epoxy you're gonna use I need to bring this epoxy back so I can pour it. Okay. This one, I need two. And then this is three. Remember, y'all, I'm working from a phone, so it's not going to be a perfect thing. So I got to see what colors I'm going to use. she would like and when you use your colors when you do a pasta you do not have to use a lot of paint you just do a drop just like this like drop but if you're using a lighter color then you use more as you go you always add more I think I'm gonna use white purple white like white I add a little more white about to be gone white I add a little more and I think I give her pink the dog and I'm on YouTube so don't come in here huh why do it well I'm actually not on YouTube but this video gonna go on YouTube you can talk okay. Can you make you like a hot pocket or something like that? When you get finished. Watch out. Okay, first I'm going to put the purple on there. And you just drizzle it like that. This epoxy kind of thick though. Just like this, y'all. You just drizzle it on there just like this. With each color you're gonna use, make sure you use all that color that you're gonna use so it can be all over your tumbler. Again, I'm not perfect. This is just a hobby for me, but I learned from YouTube, so I said, why not do a YouTube video to teach somebody else? But I'm pretty sure I'm gonna get even better at it. 
practice makes perfect. See, that looks good already, y'all. I just love it. Make sure you use all your paint, baby. Don't be shy. Use it all. Drizzle it all. Get it all on the cup. Okay, let me get some white in there. Get some white in there. I got some purple up in there. Oh, y'all, look at the white. Oh, I love doing this. This is like therapeutic for me. I'm going to start using my Cricut machine and write the nice wholesome godly things on mine excuse the noise somebody want to drive that challenger or whatever they want to flex their muscles in their car but i'm start um writing things only when i get more comfortable like jesus loves you jesus saves jesus don't like self-hate you have dominion over this earth through christ jesus you know, little stuff like that and just give it away. Like, just bless my neighbors, the kids, whoever wants one. Just bless them with a tumbler. And I believe that's how I'm going to get my blessing, by blessing others with what God gives me and taught me how to do.